Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome to Meds in the Morning. It's the end of our week. Today is Friday. I hope you had a wonderful week. Remember that this week we have been praying for... Okay, so let's grab that coffee and get ready to rumble. Okay, this morning our affirmations come from 1 Thessalonians, ugh, Thessalonians 3 verse 12, 2 Corinthians 6 verse 14, and Luke 6 verse 37. So let's jump in. Okay, so Luke 6 verse 37 says, Do not judge and you will not be judged. Do not condemn and you will not be condemned. Forgive and you will be forgiven. Okay, uh... Next verse is from 2 Corinthians 6, verse 14. Let me just find that. 2 Corinthians 6, verse 14 says, Do not be yoked together with unbelievers, for what do righteousness and wickedness have in common? Or what fellowship can light have with darkness? Hallelujah. The next verse, the next affirmation comes from 1 Thessalonians 3, verse 12. Let me just find it here for you. Mm, oops, let me scroll back down. Ah, uh, here. May the Lord make your love increase and overflow for each other and for everyone else, just as ours does for you. All right, so our affirmations are, and declarations, may the Lord make our love increase and overflow each for each other and everyone else. Second affirmation says, I will not be yoked together with unbelievers, for righteousness and wickedness have nothing in common, nor can light have fellowship with darkness. Third affirmation says, I will not judge, so I will not be judged. I will not condemn, so and I will not be condemned. I will forgive, so that I may be forgiven. Hallelujah. So, I wish you all a wonderful weekend. I pray that you get some rest. I pray that you just rest in the Lord. You know, um, the Lord says we must enter into his rest. I mean, he didn't rest on the seventh day because he needed rest. You know, he did it so that we could have an example that we need to rest. All right. So before I go, let me just once more just share with you our promotion that we're having for December. Let's pray. Father, we thank you for this week in which we declared your word over our relationships, whether they be platonic or intimate relationships. Father, we just thank you that your word is yea and amen and it cannot fail. Thank you, Lord, that we have spoken these words and according to your word in Psalm 103 verse 20 that angels hearken to perform the voice of the word of God. So, Father, we thank you that angels have gone forth to perform these words in the name of Jesus. And so, Lord, we give you all glory and honor and praise, mighty God. I thank you, Lord, for persons who will see this 
episode and be blessed mighty god i thank you for a word spoken in season i thank you lord that you'll make every crooked path straight and that you will have, you have already gone ahead in their timelines to sort out the following week father thank you lord that you bless us and keep us and cause your light to shine upon us and be gracious unto us and give us your peace in the name of jesus amen have a wonderful wonderful day week Enjoy your weekend. Rest. Live life to the fullest.